Now you've experienced audio syncing for the podcast. So no, no, it, it is podcast night because that is why Huck is here. He never comes over just to hang out. He never comes over just to visit. He comes over so that I can film him. And I can eat pizza. Also yes. that. A lot of pizza. A lot of pizza. A lot. And this is Jackie, who is our guest for tonight on the podcast. You guys will see her full in the podcast. Full. Full. I don't know what word I was <laughs> trying to put Jackie. there. The full Jackie experience will be in the podcast on uh, on Monday. Right now it is Wednesday. <laughs> so you are the first person we have asked about the podcast setup and the pre-show. We hint about the pre-show sometimes. And how it is vastly more interesting than the actual show. <laughs> to be fair, standing invitation. Anybody who wants to c- come and buy us dinner can bring the pre-show. There you mm-hmm. go. But, uh, yeah, what are your thoughts on the... Before having ever done the podcast, what are this your thoughts on This is my first podcast? podcast, even. Not just <sighs> the first time doing this podcast. Thank you so much for coming, My man. first ever podcast. Yeah. But, yeah, reflections on your first podcast. Are you looking was... forward to it? Are you nervous? Are you scared? I am looking forward to it. I'm... No, not that. Have we made you feel safe? I do. I feel safe. Oh, thank you. <laughs> that is the goal. And full of pizza. That's and good. full of... The pizza helps everyone pizza. feel safer. It makes everything better. Yeah. Unless you're lactose intolerant. Then yeah. it probably well, doesn't you can help. Get, you can get different pizza. Yeah, you can accommodate true. that. Same if you're gluten intolerant. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'd figure it out. I know somebody who's allergic to tomatoes. I... Really? Hmm. Yep. Yeah. Apparently. That, that we're not going to accommodate... Well, I mean, you, well, you could, could do pizza without yeah. that. You got like pesto sauce, and yeah. chicken and broccoli. Yeah. Or barbecue chicken. <laughs> barbecue don't, sauce. Don't waste well, my you've time seen the, you've seen the with pretzel, your glorified bruschetta. The pretzel pizza, but it's got like the nacho cheesy orangey sauce instead. Oh, cheese. That sounds, no, tomato, no tomato in that one. That sounds terrible. <laughs> it's better in theory. Lots of things are better in theory. Anyway, yeah, we're going to talk, um, you'll see us on Monday, talking about the new uh, phys ed and health curriculum. And which then, includes sex. Which includes sex. And then a month after that, talking about romance. A month? Yep. Wow. Don't want, it, not too, don't want too much Jackie. Well, yeah, I, I don't see, think I they see, can handle like it. That out. Yeah. yeah. Besides, we did this great podcast with AY about grad school. Yeah. Yes, you have to show that one. I mean, she needs she needs her time. Well, especially because in the spotlight. Actually, really, it's our time in the spotlight with her. Yeah. But, <laughs> but April is the month when the acceptance letters comes out, so yep. it'd be a very appropriate time to release that episode. Awesome. Also, you got a software update. Yeah, it happens. Yeah. I, I'll try to ignore it. But... <laughs> until until it like forces you to restart your computer. Not even then. That's McAfee. <laughs> McAfee can get F. <laughs> it's basically a virus. It's trying to stop you from getting effed. Isn't that the point of McAfee? I have an antivirus already. One that works much better and is less <laughs> insistent. It became a metaphor for the anti-sex ed people. They're like <laughs> McAfee. They're, they're trying to be useful, but they're essentially a virus. I think you have overextended that. That's okay. I love mixed metaphors and overextending the metaphors beyond their usefulness. I know. Yes. Everybody wave at the camera. And I will be